Five generations of this family have now been providing the townspeople with quality meats and meat products for over 120 years, including their specialty, black pudding or blood sausage. This rather medieval dish has a fanatical following. In Ron Ramsbottom, outside Manchester, hundreds compete annually in the World Black, throwing, black Pudding Throwing Championships. The bloody sausages are encased in ladies' tights, and contestants hurl them at a 20-foot high stack of Yorkshire puddings. <laughs> Whoever knocks the most Yorkshire puds off the stack is declared the winner. The contest is said to date back to an incident in battle between the armies of the Houses of Lancaster and York during the War of the Roses. <laughs> The lovely sweep of the Wharf Valley, and away to the right, the trees at the top of Rawdon Billing can be clearly seen from this vantage point. Turn right after the bridge and continue down Hack Farm Road, skirting a collection of old vehicles on the right, and follow the main that runs behind Hyroid's hospital grounds. Since October 8, 1888, Menston has lived in the shadow of the West Riding Pauper Lunatic Asylum. The empty courtyard of buildings at the rear of the hospital was once a hive of activity, housing the butchers, bakers, laundry, dairy, cobblers, and upholsterers. Sue Greenwood, who was a student nurse at the hospital from 1972, remembers how the asylum provided them with everything they needed. I remember all the shops, and we would even grow all our own vegetables here, and there was a farm and animals, she said. The patients were once responsible for working in the garden, but the government stopped it in the 1960s because it was exploitation. Now it is boarded up, awaiting the, awaiting the next stage of development to be turned into office blocks. Walk down between the privet hedges and head straight towards a small copse. As you emerge from the thicket, veer slightly left, and soon you'll reach a few more sparsely spaced trees. Looking across the field on your right, you can see the remains of an old stone dwelling. The date 1672, carved in stone above the porch door. Reputedly, this was the home of an astrological doctor. Here he comes, which pickles, <laughs> whose existence is recorded by John Timms, no relation, in his book English Eccentricities and Eccentrics, published in 1875. Strange things were told of him, such as he performed incantations at midnight when particular planets were in the ascendant. A short distance further down, go through a stile on your right into a field, head diagonally for the far corner of the field. Before the corner is actually reached, look to your left for another style, which leads you back to Burley train station. Aha. The station has been unstaffed since October 1968, and this has resulted in some vandalism over the years. Monday to Saturday, daytime services run to and from Leeds and Bradford twice per hour, and there are four services every hour to Ilkley. 